Next. Sa equivalent grade, uh, we'll be using the formula that we use no, sa school ta. So, we refer first sa score, no row score, divided by, wala nyo na ni, di ba? Total number of items, which is 70. And then that 70 will be fixed. Hindi natin gusto nga i-change ni Excel later as we drag or copy the formula. Do you follow? So therefore, uh, iset ta ang G8 into an absolute reference. Can you still recall how to set an, a reference absolute? Ano nga nagina timo ta para maging absolute ng reference? Yes. We press function for or F4. Did, didn't you do this last sem? Okay. Para si 70, hindi ta na mag 51. Hindi ta na mag 6. Kaya karoon kung i-jog down, ta ni ma-change ra. If we don't fix it or if we don't set it as an absolute reference. Kasi we have two types of reference, no? Relative and absolute. Ang relative, nag-change na siya. Should we jog or copy the formula? And then, ang absolute, ra ta na change Depende kung ano rang ginset mong absolute reference, ang column or ang row. Pero you can set both the row and the column. Para hindi siya yung mag-change at all. Okay. So, and uh, times 50 plus 45. Amunan siya, enter. If there's no problem with your, with your, what's this? With your uh, formula. Okay na? Class kita, most ang ano, there are lots of decimal places here. And we want to reduce it. There are ways for you to reduce the decimal place, no? So, pwede man class nga, hindi uh, ganda ang decimal place. <laughs> Sa home. Hindi, hindi ba display kay gamay akong screen, gina-reduce ni ano? Gina-reduce ni... Sa ano gani? Sa number? Uh, sa number. Tapos we reduce it, no? Pwede nga mo sina. But still, ang value sina, may point na gapong ni computer mo. Pero kung gusto mo fix siya sa 81, magamit ang round function. Are you with me? And pwede natin si round function i-incorporate na dili mismo sa formula ta. We don't have we don't need to have another column, no? For another rounded of uh, equivalent grade. Instead, okay, are you with me? Are you following? Please follow what I'll do. Okay? Kadto may equivalent grade na ka mo? Para ka mag-follow. Okay, follow ka mo. Yeah. Ano pa tayo? Follow ka mo, class? Ay, iba nula. Nan, ang mura ka-follow. Ang muna karong problem talaga. Patag ito ba yun ang sila? Patatud Mapatudlo pa na sila karong. O, oh, type, type B ka mo, Anay. Isundan pa, Anay. Sige, sige. Enter ko, Anay, ha. Sundan nyo, Anay. Ang nagamit kita sa total, sa uh, formula, ha. Dahil sige, kura ko mo nga. Balma, mura kami ka-follow. Follow nyo ba na ako, Facebook? Follow. Hello, nabatanan. Ready na. Hindi ano yung girl, pag yan ang format mo, girl, balik kila na karoon. Umurahan na yung mo dita, ang first ka na kayo si Kuwi Tabi, ang class dito ko na. Iumurahan nyo, anay, na. Ang dita, ta. Hindi lang ano yung format, balik kila na karoon, ha? Karoon na ng format. Ang importante, you know, how to do the formula later, no? Kaya the rest can just be learned by you. Okay, we will give you more time to do your enhancement and formatting. But now, please, no, do what I do, no? Okay? Okay na? Because unless you experience it, you will not learn it, no? Sometimes. Okay. So, are you with me in the equivalent grid column? Do we have the same result? Do we have the same output? Kung hindi ba mo kaya sa ato cell address, okay? Kailain ninyo dyan yung type pati, that would be okay. Basta i-follow nyo lang ang procedure. Kaya hindi ka mo, you will never get lost, no? Okay. So, class, instead nga round off, na doon sa separate nga column, i-incorporate na natin si round off, diri sa formula, ta, are you with me? That can be done, no? So, we'll type 
the name of a function that is round because we will round it off. Then, class, we will do the open parenthesis twice. You with me? Because the first parenthesis is for the result of the formula. Ang sa inner, dapat i-compute niya na, na i-compute no? Tapos, ang sa outer, that would already be the zero for the zero round of digit, no? Zero digit na value. Ah, wala na siya. Then, enter, you don't need to to adjust the decimal place, it will already be a whole number. It will already be a whole 81. What is that? What is decimal place? If you compute that, that will already be 81 and no more. Okay? Kay kasi, if you are to compute 81, nga ginahin mo lang decimal place, still mag-computation, kasi si Excel may decimal na ang compute no? But if you do it this way, it will already be 91 na wala na sa masyado. Shadow, no? So that that's it. Then, just drag it down to copy para ready na siya for your data entry. Okay? So, amun equivalent grades ang the rest of the scores, no? Why, why 49? Nagana ba ni sila? Kaya wala pa sila din scores. So, that will also happen to you, no? Kung wala ka mga quiz ta, no? Late-late ka mga klase, wala ka mga quiz. Or may kulang ka mo sa scores, no? Sa doon yung mga activities. And let's move on to the remark, Okay? Did you follow? Did you do it right? Yes. Did you copy the formula down? Okay. Mo iba tara wala. Mura makapadali ka na sa taro. Nanginad yung parang wala ka follow. Oi, chat box na na. Hindi na ako pa-browse. Ikaw wala ka pa kunin yo eh. Sige. Karo di lang tayo pandita ha. Kain ko mo tayo. For now, let's just do this first. Okay, we don't have much time on 9 o'clock. May nested if pa kita nga i-perform. Okay. Are you ready for the remark? Kasi you will not experience it, no? You will not know or learn it if you don't do it. Okay? May bragi ng bata nga, we have to learn it in five senses, no? We see. No, we touch. We hear. We act, no? We do it. We do it. Okay, so for the remark, this will already be the use with the use of the if function. Okay, we will be using if, no, by typing if after the equal sign. And then open parenthesis. Refer to the grade which you want to have a remark on. Nakapasar pala ini or wala, no? We'll just be, uh, 75 is the baseline. Okay, if the grade is greater than... Or equal to, you can also have no, uh, greater than or equal to. Pero kung magamit sa greater than, T74, i mo nga ano eh, nga baseline data. That means the value must be, okay, 75 and above. Okay? Hindi ko mas 74 na siya, kung ma less than 74 na siya, mas failed na siya eh. Okay, so then we'll have to have a comma after the first argument. Then i quote na to sa quotation mark ang first na remark that we want to be returned by the application. Okay? So, type there, past, if you want a remark past. Okay? Then, closing quotation. And then, after closing quotation, we have to have a comma. And then, for the second remark, for the false result, no, kung false result niya, uh, less than, tana 74, then this will be the remark. Okay? Then, it will become failed. We follow. That would be all. Then close it. Wala na kita sa other nga mga parenthesis, no? Kaya wala na makita inner, no? Inner, uh, what's this, uh, computation. So if it's done, then you have to just enter key, no? Then you will have your result. Why passed? Because 81 is greater than 74. And that is true, that 81 is greater than 74. That's why it returned to you, know the past remark. Okay, then you have to just copy the formula. You don't have to do it again and again every time. That's just autofill, no? The first formula. Why failed? Eh, wala na. Tiyan mo mo tabukan ninyo kung wala ka mo permit score. No, zero. Okay, failed ka eh. Matapos mag-question, baka mas ang grade nyo. Mama, no, kulang ko. May sudyante, bala rin nga. Dahil auto na yung complete grade na, no? Tapos naman, kung sa ako, mama, no, kulang ko. 
Sige ma'am, huwag ka man sa eh. Naging pasa ka. Wala lagi kang maging pasa, ma'am. Pati kung may tulang ka, bisa ni isa. Tanan tulang mo eh, tanan ka di. Okay. So, amo na siya. Are we ready for the next level? This is how you are to do it, no? Okay. Everybody done? Hindi nyo na po fill out DNA, karun lang. Next, ma-move kita, ma-switch kita, ma. Do you have any question verification on this? Wala. Karun nyo na fill out, kaya nyo ako matayin, ha? Let's move on to the next sheet. Alagin yung butang ko, panigri sa grading sheet ko nga, pag yung sample. Anyway, class record. Sige, class record, panigali. Anyway. So, class, uh, I want you to learn how to copy-paste, no? Wala nyo naman yung mag-copy-paste inyo ang sheet, di ba? Okay, so copy na lang na ito. Hindi yung maparang hindi nagtayawan, ha? Right-click. Right-click ka mo sa sheet name. Puta nga na ito, if, ah. Puta nga ta, if. Para balanta kung ano na siya nga ang exercise na dira, no? If. If a picture pin, no? If. Right-click kita sa if. Sheet. Can change naman ninyo nga sheet name. Kisa ako ma-realize ko yung na ginagaan. Kura point ang nag-change ka mga if, no? Mining damo ka mo na balaan. Ka-change sa mga sheet names, no? Kabalo mag-change and so on. Mag-personalize, mag mag-customize, no? Sa mga file. That's add points to you, no? Wala ko lang rin kinamension, pero ginadugan ko na. Okay, so again, right-click sa names ng sheet, then move or copy. Then, click on the create a copy. Check that. Okay, move mo lang siya kung diin. Sa end lang, ah. Tapos, click Okay. Anyway, wala man na sa iba nga content pa man dira, no? Pero anyway, move lang sa end. Okay, da yun. So, may ara na siya class nga 2. I-move ko lang yun. Paringot sila. Iibutan nga natin si, ni siya nga nested if. Para ba lang, tanga. Amo ni si nested if, tanga activity, no? Amo na siyang if lang yun, no? Okay, that's how you are going to label properly your file, no? Or your sheet in the workbook in Excel. Are we ready for the next level? Okay. So, ma-add kita, i-change na ito ng remark. Okay? I-raise na ito na yun. Okay, study na ito. So, nested rin. Nested if. You with me? Dapat may mga score na di. Para nga daw yun. May gawang result na. Buday-budlay. Hindi guru test na lang mo. Nag-iban ka dyan. Nag-15 naman. Patangan yung man variation, may ara. Di nga, para late, no? T9 na na score, 21, 25. Bako na ba? Ha, kami yung dugtama. Ano? Ano nagagalagaw? Iba na, o? Ay, hindi ka po na kasar. Kasi dapat kompleto, kit. na ba sa grace force wala mo di pasar anyway na admit mga taas man dapat di 40 dapat may mga 23 siya maka na ba kaya maka na ba at dapat sa din 24. Para may 95 man. Okay. Okay? Ha, perfect yun naman. Ah, kay 24. Then, ako 220. Lamaan lamang. Oh, sige na. Okay. So, huwag complete ko na lang, class. Para nga, karoon ang effect nyo. Bala may variation. Okay. Sige. Ready na ta sa remark? Okay. So, this is our criteria for the remark. If the grade is the grade is seventy four and below, we di man type yun niya pero hindi niya nila sa computation ta guide lang niya tayo. The remark would be failed or failed lang ang failed. If it is seventy five to eighty two, good nan. Good talaga, ikamayan talaga natin ng mga remark. Bago talang, if it is 83 to, uh, let's say, 90, ay hindi lang imo, talang din lang sa 88. Then, very good. 
If it is uh, 89 to 92, di man gid. Ano ano yung antes excellent? Ano ano? Great. May excellent na kita sa 95. 93 to 95. Kaya mo rin pinakataas. It will be excellent. Favorite nyo kitang excellent, ha? So, we have five conditions. We have five logical tests to be make, to be made in the remark. Okay? So, dapat ang grades, hindi kung ano, dapat may 90, may 90, ano man kita, no? Let's say, diri ko ito, asunta niya, na, 13, tapos na yung tanin yung 9, yung tanin yung 22. Ay, mabag na ako na. Bilan, ah, okay, 19 ini. Butangan taman sang 95 bala da daw. Ang diri mo, tanga 24, muta 14, muta ni nga 10, perfect niya ni sa first. Isus. Nan, parang may 93 man diri. Okay, almost perfect na ang mga score, mga quiz. Nan, okay. Sige. Ready na ta for the remarks? Class, unod ka mo, class. Follow. Follow the, the procedure. Okay, hindi nyo namin ni Han. Okay, ilaw. We didn't need, especially in this part. Tapos may tendency nga ang inyo, kasi nga itiwan, ma-overlap na karoon kang inyo ang content. So, tandaan nyo lang kiti yung address. It's H9. Okay? So, H9. Kung hindi nyo karoon siya mag-click, kay nag-overlap, di type po nyo na lang kay okay lang nag-apon. Okay? Ready na ta? Mas start na ta? Sa remark kita ha? Butang ta remark ang itiwan ha? Lima ka different remark yung itest ni Excel. Mapili siya da sa lima. Kundi yung nagmatch yung mga grade. You follow? So let's start it. Equal sign. Can you see? Let's zoom in. Equals, no? Next. If. Open parenthesis. 81. Mas manda ba kita ma-follow kita sa ano is less than 75 ang value who are, which are less than 75 they are 74 and below so therefore this is our first condition ang iyang mark is failed okay failed siya no hindi ko makikita kay nag uh, then batang tang kung true siya then failed since we have, okay, since we have another condition, maka, makita, sugpunan ta, ha? Kada ano, rakla si separator sa kama, kada argument, ha? If, ma-if kita again, open parenthesis, same procedure, same syntax, follow the syntax. Uh, still, same, uh, ano to ganun, H9, type nyo na lang kung hindi na mapindot si H9, kaya nakovera na siya. Come, uh, less than, ano tong next? Dili kita mabase, oh. 83. Kaya dapat masulod si 82. Okay? So, butang tadi 83. Because we refer to the value that which are greater than 80 or less than 83. That is 82 to 75. Masulod siya di, oh. 82 to 75. Dili siya mabase, oh, na. Okay? Then, if true, the the remark would be, sundan nyo lang, anay, karun yung karun na kamunta mo. Good. Okay? Next naman, kaya may next pagkikita yung audition, Ma-if na naman kita, if open H9 gapon, we refer to the same reference. Ano next? Oh, anong value? Ano next? 8080, no? So, masulod si 88, butang tadi, 89. Okay? After that, butang tang true result, anong equivalent niya kung 89? Very good. Close. O sige, nagamon na naman na. Basta yung magtalang ka mo, ha? Hindi ka mo magtalang-talang. Kung nag-naog siya. Kama, okay? If again, tapos type mo to H9, hindi na natin sila mapindot. Ano na next? Okay. So, masulod si 93. So, butang natin di. Uh, masulod ka rin si 92, no? So, di rin nakita sa grade na kita. Is less than 93, kasi that we refer to the value 92 to 89. Then, butang mo daang true value, great. Class, we don't have any more logical test, ha? 
Kaya isa na lang atong nga, excellent, no? Isa na lang atong nga, i-refer nga, remark. So, maenda kita diri, no? Kay 89 to 92 nga logical test. Because the 93 and above would already mean, excellent, we don't need to have a logical test for that. It is already be understood by the Excel na excellent. So, tanahin nga, wala tayong butang sa logical test. So, kung kapila kita mag-open parenthesis, kapila kita mag-open, cap at, so cap at, magkita mag-close. For 1, 2, 3, 4. Because otherwise, may error ka. Kaya dapat every open should have an ending or closing. Okay? Okay, enter. Then, why good? Kaya diri siya na fall sa amunin nga range, no? 75 to 82. Good. When I drag down ko ni, automatically, ma-decide si computer kung ano iya nga remark. So good money field ini great. Good. O di ba? Hindi ka na mag mano-mano decide. It's already the computer, or it's already the application that would make a decision based on your argument or your formula or function. None. Excellent. Failed. 